a reality is defined as a hear it, smell it, taste it, touch it environment. And your reality is a direct reflection of the energy that you have been embodying each and every day because your outer world is a direct reflection of your inner world. You see, this universe or this law of attraction in this universe, it speaks in vibration. It doesn't speak in words, it doesn't speak language, right? The language is vibration, it's energy, it's emotion. And the reason that you are experiencing everything that you are in your physical reality is simply from the beliefs that you hold, the thoughts that you've been practicing about reality, about these certain subjects that hold high importance and value to you in your life. Overall, it's a direct reflection of who you are being right now in the present moment. But what I want to share with you in this video is that you could be, do, or have anything that you want in this reality by coming across this information, by coming to a new understanding about this information. Because once you understand this and get a grasp of your own vibration, you'll be able to create whatever reality that you want. You'll be able to become the deliberate creator of your reality that you've always intended to be, that you came to Earth to live and fulfill and experience, right? And that's exactly what I'm going to show you in this video. By the time this video ends, you're going to know how to reprogram your subconscious mind to shift realities, to shift to the reality that you prefer because you're going to become more of, a, more of a vibrational match to the version of you that's already there living this reality, living this experience. And the more that you bask and be in this energy, the more that reality will give you the reflection that you're desiring. Check it out. Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to Meditation with Christopher. Now, how can we reprogram our subconscious mind to shift to any reality that we want so we can experience any reality, any lifestyle, any experience that we can imagine here on Earth? How do we do it? First, understand that, like I was saying before, really it's a vibrational journey. It's an emotional journey that we're on here on Earth. The law of attraction is responding to our emotions which are our internal guidance system, always leading us to where we are truly meant to be, right? And the only reason why you ever experience negative emotion ever is simply because the source within you, what you truly believe, your higher self, this source energy within you, who you truly are, doesn't believe the thoughts that you are thinking about that subject. And that's the only reason why you experience or feel negative emotion is because in some way, shape, or form, you aren't up to speed with what life has caused you to become. And that's, it's okay, that's the point of contrast, right? To help us get clear who it is that we are and what we do want to experience, right? Now, the only problem is, a lot of times, our subconscious mind is stuck on repeat. It's stuck giving us the same things, right? We're thinking the same things, we're experiencing the same things over and over and over again. And this is because of our focus and our attention, right? One of the most powerful things I always say to you guys and offer it to you guys is that whatever you focus on grows in this universe and paying attention is always gonna be the greatest form of energy exchange that there ever was. Where you place your attention, energy flows, okay? And the reason why we are stuck experiencing certain things over and over and over again, right, is because of our focus and our attention to what is. And what is, right, this see it, smell it, hear it, taste it, touch it, reality that we are experiencing. What is, is simply just a temporary reflection of the energy that we've been embodying. And I'm here to share with you that by reprogramming your subconscious mind, you can get out ahead of it. You can get out ahead of the game, the law of attraction, the manifestation game, right, in manifesting your desired reality. You can get out ahead of it by reprogramming your subconscious mind, okay, which simply means reaching for new beliefs, reaching for new thoughts that do feel good to you, that are in alignment with what the source within you is truly believing. In other words, if you've been practicing a thought about something that you really want to happen and you've been opposing that by thinking, oh, this isn't working out for me or, oh, this is hard to do or it's hard for me to manifest this stuff, right? I'm not good at this, right? If you're opposing that, then chances are you're gonna be experiencing negative emotion because you're opposing your own desire, which is meant to be fulfilled, okay? So 
with reprogramming the subconscious mind, understand that it's important to use your emotions, which are your internal guidance system, to let you know where you are vibrationally, right? If you're not liking what you're experiencing in your physical reality, it's time to start reprogramming your subconscious mind to become more of a vibrational match to the version of you that's in their desired reality, okay? So start reaching for the beliefs and the thoughts that you want to think about these subjects in your life, right? Start telling a new story. A lot of times we experience the same reality over and over again because of the story that we tell ourselves. We wake up and this is the story about my life. This is how, who I am. This is how my life works. This is how my reality is. And we hold ourselves in that reality as long as we continue to tell the story, right? So we have to start reaching for the thoughts that we want about these subjects, right? Start telling things how you want them to be. Start seeing things how you want them to be. And reality will eventually start shifting things around you as you start to truly become a match to this reality, which means you're in alignment with the version of you that's there, which means your beliefs, your thoughts, your feelings, and your actions, your vibration, is a match to that reality. It's just like a radio station. If you want to see and perceive of what's happening on 98.2, you got to tune into that station. You can't expect to tune into 68.1 and hear what's being broadcasted over here. It's just vibrationally illogical, right? <laughs> so how, do, can we, how can we reprogram our subconscious mind to shift to any reality that we want? Realize that it's as simple as that. It's easy. It's, a, it's, it's easy as reaching for the thoughts that we want about these subjects, all right? And you can do powerful meditation. You can do all sorts of different things to help reprogram and rewire your mind to start practicing the thoughts that you want, right? But overall, it's going to come from you coming into alignment with who it is that you really are. Overall, you setting this intention to, to want to become a vibrational match to the version of you that's in their desired reality or experience, right? You have to have a willingness to go. You have to have an allowance to go. You have to have a certain <laughs> believing in oneself, okay? And that's how you're going to experience any reality that you want. And that's how you're going to reprogram your subconscious mind, right? There's a meditation you can check out that I've created that will help you to do this. It's actually shift to your desired reality. Guided meditation, right? You do it for 21 days and it will totally rewire your internal vibration. And thus you'll get a different reality on the outside the more that you hold steady in that energy, right? You'll build momentum in your outer physical reality, okay? Now, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you leave a thumbs up if you did, and subscribe if you haven't already. But other than that, peace, love, and namaste. I'll see you guys next time. Later.